Let's go to 1 John chapter 3, 8 through 9. To the left is the King James Version, to the right is the Expanded Bible. He that committeth sin is of the devil. So what is that saying? This disproves the doctrine of once saved, always saved, where people believe that they are of God, they are saved, they are going to heaven after death, while they are continuing on this earth to persistently sin and not repent. This verse is showing that doctrine is wrong, as you can see here. For the devil sinneth from the beginning. For this purpose the Son of God was manifested, that he might destroy the works of the devil. So Jesus Christ came down to earth to destroy the works of the devil. But you are saying that you are of God when you are persistently sinning. But how can that be true? When Jesus came to destroy the works of the devil. So sin is what? Persistently sinning, rebelling against God is what? The works of the devil. So how can you be doing the works of the devil and say that you are of God? It makes no sense. So just because you go to a church three times a week, two times a week, whatever, if you are persistently sinning without repenting, you are not of God. You are of the devil, as this verse is saying. Verse 8. Okay, verse 9. Whoever is born of God doth not commit sin. So this is saying, if you are of God, you are not going to sin. Let me say this. As humans, we are going to make mistakes. Everyone is going to make a mistake. But real servants of God are not going to persistently sin all day, every day. That is not going to happen. That is not going to happen. If you are doing that, I am not trying to discourage you, but you still have a way to go to become a servant of God. You are not there yet. Work more toward it. For his seed remaineth in him, and he cannot sin because he is born of God. So what this is saying when you truly serve God, there is going to be a difference within you. You are not going to be like a sinner. Your words, your actions, everything about you is going to be different than a sinner. Your mentality is going to be different as well. This is how we know when a person is really a servant of God. Your church attendance does not play a role in your righteousness. It really does not. It is your total life, your obedience to God, which is going to determine if you are righteous or not. I pray that this makes sense. So this once saved, always saved doctrine, and I continue to hear this, this phrase where God knows my heart. As you can see here, he that committeth sin is of the devil. So you can say God knows your heart. Yes, he does. He knows that you are of the devil if you committeth sin. Ha, 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 ha.
So you can't use that as an excuse to continue to sin. You can't do that, as you can see here. So I pray that this makes sense. So stop using that phrase because you have to sacrifice to live for God properly. All the real servants of God have sacrificed something, actually everything, in order to serve God properly. I know I have. God bless.